Cristiano Ronaldo hits back at fly after France football boss Stokes Lionel Messi rivalry fair, who organizes the awards, spoke to the New York Times ahead of this year's ceremony and reportedly revealed information from a private conversation with Ronaldo. Ronaldo has only one ambition and that is to retire with more Ballon d'Or than Messi. I know because he has told me, Ferre reportedly told the Times. Ronaldo, who snubbed the event on Monday, posted a message on social media before Messi claimed his record-extending seventh Ballon d'Or, disputing what Ferre had claimed. Today's result explains why Pascal Ferreira's statements last week, when he said that I confided in him that my only ambition was to finish my career with more Ballon d'Or trophies than Lionel Messi, Ronaldo wrote. Pascal Ferre lied, he used my name to promote himself and to promote the publication he works for. It is unacceptable that the person responsible for awarding such a prestigious prize could lie in this way, in absolute disrespect for someone who has always respected France football and the Ballon d'Or. And he lied again today by justifying my absence from the ceremony with an alleged quarantine that has no reason to exist. Read, Lionel Messi wins 7th Ballon d'Or while Alexia Putellas wins her first women's title I always win for myself and for the clubs I represent the Ballon d'Or is voted for by 180 journalists and presented by France Football to the best men's and women's player of the year. Ronaldo is now two awards behind Lionel Messi after finishing sixth in this year's rankings. It was the first time he finished outside the top five since 2010. He added, I always want to congratulate those who win within the sportsmanship and fair play that have guided my career from the beginning, and I do it because I'm never against anyone. I always win for myself and for the clubs I represent, I win for myself and for those who love me. I don't win against someone. The biggest ambition of my career is to leave my name written in golden letters in the history of world football. There were also some who thought Liverpool forward Mohamed Sola, who was placed seventh, deserved to be ahead of Ronaldo. Despite his side not winning a trophy last season, Sulla scored 22 league goals and has started this year with some eye-catching performances. Jorginho, who won the Champions League with Chelsea in Euro 2020 with Italy, finished third. Meanwhile, Barcelona's Alexia Putellas won her first Ballon d'Or title after the 27-year-old was instrumental in her side's treble winning season. Her victory took center stage in Spanish media with Marca leading its coverage on her win with the headline historic. Fellow Barcelona star Pedri also picked up the award for best young men's player. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.